lifelong friend and musical co-conspirator Lee Hirons. Together, Billy and Lee, along with their brothers and some other guys from their neighborhood, formed the band Scruff. They pressed a single and even made some afternoon TV appearances. No, that's not Billy. That's show host Roy North. Scruff is the guest. Now we're going to meet our first guest now. This is their first hit single. Uh, it's from Scruff. It's called Get Out of My Way. So many people around me I can't see the light There's somebody in this place as with so many teenage bands, Scruff didn't stay together very long, but soon Billy and Lee formed a new band, the Faith Brothers. It was the Faith Brothers who got signed by Virgin Records and looked like they could be the next big thing out of London. Very sort of, very sort of lovely, a bit Christmassy as well. Um, some questions on the cards for you. Come on then, Bill. What you got? Do you ride a bike? No, I gave it up. Did you? Yeah. Why? I had a slight accident. Did you really? <laughs> yeah. Did somebody so, run into you or did you fall off? Well, somebody ran into me, but yeah. I think I may have asked for it. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Does your headband go all the way round? Well, it's a bootlace, actually. <laughs> is yeah. it really? Is it a bootlace? <laughs> yeah. Is it really? Did yeah. you get the idea from Princess Di? No, I've got it from a pair of shoes. <laughs> <laughs> you asked for that one. I love being top. That's just the way that it is with me. That's just the way that it could, could, should be. That's just the way that it is with me. Keep on pushing it. Possibly they were too political for the feel-good 80s, or maybe it was just those damn hairstyles. Either way, two albums later, true mainstream success still eluded them. Virgin declined a third album, and the brothers broke up. 